the biggest matches of the night, our game of the week is an interesting one. Mm -hmm. Grace Community taking on the Spring Hill Panthers, and that's where we'll find our Bryce Braun Eisen to give us the keys to this matchup. How you doing, Bryce? Ashley, David, I'm doing pretty good. I'm getting ready for a pretty good game here. The Spring Hill Panthers have traveled down to Tyler to take on the Grace Community Cougars, who are undefeated on the year. Spring Hill's going to look to spoil that. And we know once the pads get hidden and once everyone's on the football field, anything can happen. The Spring Hill Panthers started off the season hot. A big fourth quarter comeback to beat Sabine on the first night of the East Texas football season. But since then, it's been tough sledding. Star quarterback and senior leader Jack Stovall went down week two in center with a torn ACL. And they've lost a lot of key players since then too with injuries as the Panthers have adopted that next man up mentality. Well, next man up a quarterback, Zane Mason. And head coach Brandon Jocelyn is proud of Mason for stepping right into the fire as the Panthers try to turn their season around. Zane Mason's been a positive, just stepping in that role after Jack's, you know, had his little incident and stepping up and, and running the offense. Uh, we've had some other guys that we told our offensive guys, hey, Zane doesn't need to lead the offense, you need to lead him. So that's been a very big positive for us right now. On the flip side, the home team has seen nothing but success so far. The Grace Community Cougars have started off the season 4-0 behind some strong victories over quality opponents. It's been a full team effort so far with players from every position stepping up and delivering when the Cougars need it most. Head coach Tim Russell knows that Spring Hill is going to be fired up to try and give them their first loss of the year, but he feels that him and his team are prepared for that challenge. But uh, looking at Spring Hill, stopping them, you know, you got to slow down their rushing attack. They they really run the ball well, uh, have a real solid defense, and they coach real well. You know, you know pretty much what you're going to get. They're in the right spots, and and they do a great job, and they play really hard. It's going to be a tremendous challenge Friday night. Like Coach Russell just said, it's going to be a tremendous challenge for both teams tonight to adapt and overcome and try and bring home that coveted CBS 19 Game of the Week victory. I think this might be a pretty close one. I know it's going to be competitive. Make sure to stick around in the show for that official helmet pregame pick. Ashley, David, back over to you.